Hi everyone, my name is Celine, Wellness Babe here on YouTube, and today I'm going to be talking about host plants and the host plants I've incorporated into my garden. In addition to having nectar plants in your garden, these host plants attract butterflies to your garden where they will lay eggs. A few days later, after the eggs have been laid, a caterpillar emerges and feeds exclusively on this plant. In this vlog, I'm going to show you my host plants and maybe you'll see some caterpillars munching away on them as well. Here we go. This is called popcorn cassia. If you rub your fingers on the leaves and then smell, you will get a sniff of butter popcorn. This is a winter cassia or Christmas cassia. Both of these plants are host to the yellow sulfur butterfly. Here is what the caterpillars look like. These are nasturtiums and they're host to the cabbage white caterpillar. And here he is. This lovely plant is called Desert Mallow and is host to the Painted Lady Caterpillar. I have not yet attracted eggs on this plant, but I'm sure it's just a matter of time. This tree in the back is a native California ash tree host to the Western Tiger Swallowtail Caterpillar. This caterpillar has a very cartoon-like animated aesthetic. Here you can see some monarch caterpillars munching away on milkweed. Make sure you do provide them with a lot of milkweed. They will eat it up. Please make sure you are using native milkweed. I have recently changed to only using native milkweed and I've noticed less disease in my caterpillars. On this day, I was able to catch this caterpillar turning into a chrysalis. I hope that you are enjoying this butterfly gardening series. Please go ahead and hit the subscribe button if you'd like to see more gardening, home, and healthy recipes. Thank you so much for watching.